Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video we are going to solve a section C question from quadratic equations chapter and this had appeared in CBSC board exam 2024. In a two digit number, the digit at the units place is 5 less than the digit at the tens place. The product of the digits is 36. Find the number. So let us try to understand the question first. They have mentioned that we have a two digit number. So let us consider here a two digit number. So this is the units place and this is the tens place. So the digit at the units place is 5 less than the digit at the tens place. So for example, if we have a number 6 at tens place, then the units place is going to be 5 less than the digit at the tens place. So it's going to be 6 minus 5, it's going to be 1. Now this is the first hint they have given. And the second hint is the product of the digits is 36. Means when I multiply these two numbers, I should get 36. So let us consider the digit at tens place to be as x. So let the digit at tens place be x. Then the digit at the units place is going to be 5 less than x. That is x minus 5. Now the next thing is the product of the digits is 36. That is when I multiply x with x minus 5, I should get the result as 36. So here we have written x times x minus 5 is equal to 36. Now the next step is expansion of the brackets on the left hand side. That is x multiplies with x giving us x square and x multiplies with negative 5 giving us a negative 5x and this will be equal to 36. Now let us take 36 on the left hand side. So we have x square minus 5x minus 36 equal to 0. Now we have to factorize this expression. That is we need to find out the factors of 36 in such a way that when we multiply them we should get negative 36 and when we add them we will get the sum as negative 5. So we have two factors here that is negative 9 and 4. That is when we multiply them we get the product as negative 36 and when we add them we get the sum as negative 5. So here we have split the negative 5x as two factors that is x square minus 9x plus 4x minus 36 equal to 0. Now the next step is grouping. We are going to group the first two terms and we are going to group the last two terms. From the first two terms we have to see which are the factors common. So we can see that x is a common factor so we are going to pull it out and inside the bracket we have x minus 9 and from the second group 4 is a common factor so we have taken plus 4 out and in the bracket we again get x minus 9 equal to 0. Now here x minus 9 and x minus 9 is a common factor again. So we are going to pull it out and we have two factors here. One is x minus 9 and the other one is x plus 4 equal to 0. Now the next step is we are going to equate each factor equal to 0 independently. So we have here x plus 4 equal to 0 and x minus 9 equal to 0. Now taking plus 4 on the other side of the equal to sign and doing the same thing for minus 9 that is taking minus 9 on the other side of equal to sign. We get two values of x that is x equal to negative 4 and x equal to 9. Now x cannot be equal to negative 4 because we have tens place and units place. So in the tens place if we have negative 4 then in the units place we have 5 less than negative 4 that is negative 9 and we do not write the two digit number in this way. So this is not a correct representation. So we are going to discard the x equal to negative 4 value. So we are going to consider the x value that is the digit at tens place as 9. So here we can see the tens place digit is become 9 now. So the units place has to be 5 less than 9 that is 9 minus 5 gives us 4. And the product of 9 and 4 also gives us 36. So it satisfies the second condition as well. That is the product of these two numbers should give us 36. So here we have written the required number is 94. I hope you have understood all the steps and liked the video. And if you found this video useful then you can click on these playlists where you will find more questions of these kind. And if you are liking my videos like share and subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.